Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at this movement script here. Alright, we're going to be seeing an action. So let me press play here. Right, as it pulls up here, we can see that it's a standard, more or less, cock controller. You can uh, turn, drive forward, drive backwards, but a few things you'll notice. Um, this is made with a trail, so that as you drive straight, no trail appears, as you'd expect. As you turn and skid, the trail appears. Next thing you might notice is the wheels. The front wheels turn as you press the arrow keys. Also, they turn the opposite way, as you'd expect, when you're reversing. So it's all really intuitive, reverse and forward. Okay, now, if we go here and look at the inspector, you can see we have a few properties here. First property is the forward acceleration. With this we can modify and change the forward acceleration of the player. So, as you can see I put it up and now it's going way, way too fast. Same thing with the reverse. Alright, turn speed, you might expect this. Changes how fast the vehicle can turn. And that looks a little bit weird. <laughs> so I'll put that back down. 175 is pretty good, I think. Um, next, we have the wheel properties. So if we go over here, we have the right front wheel. Come over here. This is what I've done with the wheels. So you can see I've actually overlaid an object, a sprite as a wheel, like that. See that? So it goes right over it and it covers up the original wheel that came with this asset pack, which I'll link in the description. So this wheel is, it covers the other wheel up and makes the script for turning the wheels work, which is pretty great. So now if I come over here and put this wheel max wheel turn up really high, you can see down there, the wheels are doing all sorts of weird stuff. Um, put it really low, you can see the wheels hardly turn. 35 is pretty good, I think. You can see it working just like that. Um, these, this right front wheel, you can see, just so I can show you here, if I put it with, which is, um, with this sprite, which is the car sprite I'm using, um, you can see the car spray actually turns, and that's definitely not what we want. So let me put that back here. There we go. Now we have the skid trails. Skid trails property. I have two skid trails here, and just as you'd expect, they're trail renderer on a game object. Um, put right on the back wheel. Just a few properties here. And what this does in the script is that if the player is going straight, it turns the trails off the emitting toggle there. I'll show you. As you can see, I'm going straight. Hold on. I'm going straight. It's off. As soon as I turn, it turns on. See that? That's all the script is doing. So I can add a ton of these trails. Oops. I can add a ton of these trails, like 100, um, and it'll do the same thing. It'll work because it's a for loop that just runs through all of them. That's what that does. And that, I think, covers up the car controller here. I'll link the code in the description, and you can pick that up. Just drag it onto your car, and you should be ready to go. Um, yes, yeah, so that's it. If you like the video, Please consider subscribing, leaving a like, and a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Yeah. Cheers.